Hey Edna, how's it going? Thank you very much for opening the video. My name is Lucas and I talked with Samantha about this video that I made for you guys, about three things that I found on your website that you can fix really easily. So you can start building a large remodel. These guys, when you look for San Diego kitchen remodel, are the top ones, okay? You see them here at the very top of Google map. And then if you go to the organic results, even though they're in fourth position, they'll be in the top in no time since they're outperforming by far all these other websites. But just by implementing these three things that I'm gonna tell you about, you will be able to beat them with no problem and securing those first two spots in no time. You may wonder why I made this video for you and the answer is really simple. I know a lot of business owners are very busy taking care of their business and their customers. Uh, so they don't have time to learn how to use the internet to bring them more business or they don't know how to hire somebody to do it because they don't know who's an expert and who's not. So I like to make these free educational videos for business owners so they can get this information. And a lot of them, they like to take it and do it themselves. But some of them, they contact me and have me doing it for them. So either one is good for me. I just do it for educational purposes. But if you like what you see and you want me to help you get in there, please feel free to contact me at any time on my phone or on my email. That said, let's jump with the video. I want to tell you about the three main things that Google uses to rank a website at the very top. Those are content, backlinks, and citations. Content is basically everything that is on your website, on your text, pictures, what is behind the picture, and how the pictures are saved as. If you see here, when we paste it in the word counter, you have almost 400 words of content. Usually, Google, for the pages that rank at the very top, they like to see about 2,000 words of keyword-rich content. If you see for large remodel, when we copy and paste the content on the same word counter as yours, they have 1500 words of keyword rich content. What is a keyword? A keyword is basically the term that people is looking up on Google when they want a service. So in this case, for example, Sadigo Kitchen Remodel is one of the most searched keywords on this aspect. So you want to drop that one a couple times throughout that content and then make some research, find some other ones and same, drop a couple times throughout those 2,000 words of content. Second thing is backlinks. Backlinks is basically another website putting a link that when somebody clicks in it, it drives them back to here, to your site. So you can imagine uh, this works kind of like a popularity contest kind of thing, okay? Because Google loves to see that a bunch of relevant pages are vouching for you, okay? But that means that uh, you can put backlinks everywhere but not all backlinks are created equal, all right? So Google takes in more consideration backlinks that are businesses related to your business. So if you get backlinks for websites that, that talk about shoes or about food, for example, they're valid backlinks, but they, don't, they won't give you as much power as if another remodeling company or a website that publish articles with uh, related with remodeling publish, uh, publish an, uh, a thing with your link in it. Okay, those links would give you way more power because they are within the same niche. So how you check backlinks? We use a tool here in Purple Room called Hrefs that I, when I put your website here, I can see that you have 12 back, 12 preferring domains at the moment. This means that there's 12 pages, 12 websites that when I go to them, somewhere in the website, there is a link that when I click it, I go back to your site. If you see large remodel over here, you have 73 referring domains. So how can you close that gap? As simple as you go here, you go through every single one of these websites and you copy them. You make a profile and you drop a link to your website on that profile, okay? That way you will have the same backlinks as them and if they're good to rank them, they're good to rank you. And then all you need to do is add a couple more on top of that so that way you make sure you beat them. And with the content and the backlinks, you'll be able to rank at the very top of these results in no time. Then I want to talk about citations, the third thing. Citations is what it gets you here. And the good thing about this is that it's completely free to get here. All you need to do is get more citations than your competition. What is a citation? It's basically your business information listed in several directories throughout the web, like Yellow Pages, White Pages, Facebook, Yelp, NG. It's, it's thousands of them out there. So what I would do, same as with the backlinks, is you check how many um, citations your competition has and you copy all of them and then you want to add at least another hundred at least on top of it 
So let's say they have 150 citations. I would put at least 300. I would copy the 150 and add another 150. That way, when they realize that you outrank them and they try to build more citations, you can start doing the same thing and it makes it really hard for them to try to get to catch up to you. So that said, a little recap. You need 2,000 words of keyword rich content. You need a healthy, strong backlink profile that you can start doing by copying the backlinks of your competition and then adding some extra ones. And then you need to build a good amount of citations to beat at least by 100 the amount of citations that your competition has. With all that, you'll be ranking on the very top of the back pack and on the organic results in no time, and getting all that extra business and all that extra calls. If you're interested in this, I would really recommend you to start as soon as possible because implementing all these things takes some time and the sooner you're done, the sooner you're beginning all that business and all those calls that I was talking about. If you decide to do it yourself, feel free to take all this information and start as soon as possible. But if you want me to help you get in there, feel free to contact me at any time so we can chat. That said, thank you very much for watching the video and if you could give me a little bit of feedback on what you think about this video, I would really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Bye.